वेलकम 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 सो टुडे वी बिगेन विद द न्यू सीरीज ऑफ स्टैंडर्ड्स दैट इज एस आर एस सरस स्टैंडर्ड्स ऑन रिलेटेड सर्विस दीज रिलेटेड सर्विस आर वॉट सर दीज आर नॉट द अश्योरेंस इंगेजमेंट नॉट द अश्योरेंस इंगेजमेंट दैट मीन्स इन दीज केसेज नो ओपिनियन इज टू बी एक्सप्रेस्ड गॉट द पॉइंट येस सर In these, there are two standards: SRS 4400, SRS 4410. Right now, we are going to revise SRS 4410. That is the engagements to perform agreed upon procedures regarding the financial information. Now, sir, the question comes: What is a agreed upon procedure? In the agreed upon procedures, you are just required to report the facts, the findings. How do I get to those facts? Sir, you have to report the factual findings, facts and findings, factual findings. How you report those factual findings by performing the specific procedures. Whatever procedures are being instructed to you, only those procedures you have to perform. So, based on the specified procedures performed, on what I have to perform the procedures on specified matter, specified matter of account. item or element of financial statement like debtors creditors related party blah 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 got it sir got it sir now sir what is the objective as i already told you you have to agree and perform the procedures based on the procedures report the factual findings sir do we have to give the opinion no 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 opinion sir why no opinion because it is not a assurance engagement so these are the basic points you need to remember sir but how will the user form the opinion user will form the own opinion matlab you don't give your conclusion based on your facts user will draw his own conclusion got the point yes sir that's why these are also called non assurance engagement now sir what is the difference between audit and agreed upon procedure the difference is related to assurance in audit you give a reasonable assurance that whether the financial statement as a whole are free from material misstatement whether due to fraud or due to error got it sir so you express a opinion but when it comes to agreed upon procedures you just need to mention the procedures performed and the factual findings users will draw their own conclusions based on your facts got the point yes sir now sir we discussed one example example of a agreed upon procedures which are performed to check the validity of creditors whether the creditors are genuine or not so what you have to do just take a listing of the creditors match it with the trial balance compare the names and outstanding balance of the creditors with the names and outstanding balance given in the trial balance now for these creditors take the confirmations obtain the confirmations from all the suppliers now whatever confirmation you get compare with the trial balance wherever are the variations report them wherever are the actual variations between the confirmation and trial balance report these facts do we have to form the opinion no users will draw their own conclusion these are the basics i hope these are clear yes sir now comes the amazing part that is the matters that are need to be agreed between the auditor and the management sir what are the terms of engagement that need to be there so the first two things that are the basic things are the nature and purpose nature of the engagement is it a audit or is it a review the answer is no it is neither of them it is neither audit neither review so no assurance is expressed got it sir second is the purpose of the engagement it can be any purpose it can be for the meeting the requirements of sebi meeting the requirements of companies act like the reports that we just discussed in the class these reports will be available in your google drive so you can any time review them also got it sir next three points are related to what see there is one typical point here it is not necessary that the person performing the agreed upon procedures is also the auditor of the company theek hai sir so how will the company allow him the entry sir company will allow him the entry only when he has id from where to get the id auntie so ask yourself auntie se id li come on auntie se id li sir what is auntie se id li nature timing and extent of procedures now these procedures are to be performed on which information so identify identify the financial information on which agreed upon procedures are to be performed and last point is li means limitation on the distribution of report these reports are only meant for those people who have agreed the audit procedures not for anyone else not for the general public so limitation on the distribution of report also one thing if this limitation is in contravention 
विद द लॉ और रेगुलेशन देन इन दैट केस यू डोंट एक्सेप्ट द ऑडिट एंगेजमेंट क्लियर क्लियर सर देन वी डिस्कस अबाउट द ऑडिट प्रोसीजर्स द गुड न्यूज वॉज वी ऑलरेडी नो अबाउट दीज प्रोसीजर्स ए आई ओ यू एनालिसिस एक्सटर्नल कंफर्मेशन I for inquiry, I for inspection, O for observation, U for recalculation, re-performance. These are the basic points you need to consider. And in case of reporting, you just need to go with the flow. Sir, what was the flow? Just remember the report that we discussed. Sir, in this report, how we need to go with the flow? See, in the report, you need to tell there were some agreed procedures to be performed. The procedures have been agreed with the parties to be performed. Then mention those procedures, nature, timing and extent of procedures performed. Also, whatever are the findings and conclusions, mention them. Along with the findings and conclusions, tell that it is neither audit, it is neither review. So, no assurance is expressed. No assurance is expressed. No assurance is expressed. Got it, sir. And last may, tell that the report is available for limited use there is limited distribution and use these are the points you need to consider and this is what we also discussed at the end procedures performed are agreed upon purpose of agreed upon procedures specific procedures performed based on the procedures performed what are the factual findings plus tell it is neither audit neither review so no assurance expressed and last way report is restricted to the people who have agreed with the audit procedures six minutes 30 seconds. Please tell me how was SRS 4400? Come on. New essay. See, I won't uh, deny the fact that these concepts are new. But didn't I tell you? Didn't I tell you in the beginning that this is very, very easy, very, very scoring if you are going in the right way? Tell me. Gotcha or not gotcha? Awesome, 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 awesome. So thanks a lot everyone for participating for the energy. Now we are going for a break and after the break we connect back and complete the another SRS. Enjoy the 15 minutes break. Your time starts now. Chalo, enjoy. Enjoy. 